this Tyrannus tip, I'll show you how to adjust your throttle stop screw to either gain or limit performance in your small engine. So right here, we're looking at the throttle on a stock Tillotson 212 engine. You'll see something similar on most small engines. What you're looking for is here's our throttle arm. And so at full throttle, it's gonna be pressed all the way this way. And if you look in here, you can see that there's this little tab on the throttle arm that comes in contact with the end of this screw. And that's what stops the throttle from going any further. So here is what your maximum throttle is. This is about where it's set from the factory. So usually what I'll do is we'll end up coming in here and I'll back this screw out about as far as I can. And now look how much more throttle and how much more travel you get. Now this is still running through the governor, so it's not direct. But the other thing that you can do is, for example, I am incredibly zoomed in intentionally because you guys have not seen this 212 or the vehicle that it is housed in and won't be seeing it for a while. But I let Bridget ride it. And so that she didn't kill herself, I went ahead and screwed this screw like all the way in. So all she had for throttle was, which is really nice. If you got kids or somebody who's never ridden anything motorized before, you can limit that down here. And so it's a nice option. And that's why I usually keep them. If you found this video helpful, hit that thumbs up so other people can find this video and squeeze a little free performance out of their ride. And subscribe to find out what's parked behind me. We'll catch you in the next one.